were looking at Exhibit 579. Um, the statement that you wrote was, Michael Jackson changed the world, and more personally, my life forever. He is the reason I dance, the reason I make music, and one of the main reasons I believe in the pure goodness of humankind. He has been a close friend of mine for 20 years. His music, his movement, his personal words of inspiration and encouragement, and his unconditional love will live inside of me forever. I will miss him immeasurably, but I know that he is now at peace and enchanting the heavens with a melody and a moonwalk. I love you, Michael. Is that right? That's what I wrote, yeah. The night prior, we both slept in the bed with Michael. Mm -hmm. um, and at some point that second night, she said to me, I think we should, you know, you and I should sleep upstairs. I don't know why. Um, I don't know why she said that or why she thought that. But I didn't want to. Um, so yeah, so then I, then, then when, whenever it was bedtime, you know, she went upstairs and Michael and I stayed in the bed downstairs. And I believe at some point that night the abuse started. Um, to help you write your book. I think along the same lines, but maybe I would ask her, you know, of a, of a certain uh, period of time, you know, could you just jot down the bullet points of what you remember? Asking my mother that, you know, of how the details of when we went to the ranch and the first time and, you know, just how did that unfold, the external details. So have your memories changed as you've gone through that process? They've evolved. What do you mean by evolved? Yeah, I mean, not changed in a, in a sort of black to white sense. Like I thought it was this thing. Well, I mean, they have as far as prior to the healing process, right? Prior to disclosing. Um, but post disclosing the abuse in, in 2012 and beginning that healing journey, they've evolved as far as I remember more details about scenarios as it goes along you know it evolves details get added to for the criminal testimony in 2005 I do do you recall where you were when you were subpoenaed I don't do you recall if you were with anyone when you were subpoenaed I don't remember how I got the subpoena this is a transcript of your testimony from the 2005 criminal trial correct Um, it appears to be that way. Robson now claims he committed the crime of perjury on the witness stand in 2005, even as skeptics point to the rigorous cross-examination he was subjected to. On line 18, you're asked, Mr. Robson, did Michael Jackson ever molest you at any time? And you said, absolutely not, correct? Correct. And that was a lie, right? That was a lie, yeah. Okay. On line 21, you're asked, Mr. Robson, did Michael Jackson ever touch you in a sexual way? And you responded, never, no, correct? Correct. And that was a lie, correct? That was what I had rehearsed with Michael. And you now claim that that was a lie, correct? That was not the truth, yeah. On line 24, you're asked, Mr. Robson, has Mr. Jackson ever inappropriately touched any part of your body at any time, correct? Correct. And your answer was no, correct? Correct. And you now claim that that was a lie, correct? That was not the truth. Can you turn to page 9100? On line 14, you were asked, and at no time has any sexual contact ever occurred between you and Mr. Jackson, right? Do you see that? Yes. And your answer was never, correct? Yes. And you now claim that that was a lie, correct? That was not the truth. That's why you all Did you attend the memorial service for Michael Jackson at the Staples Center? Yeah. Cry at the memorial service at the Staples Center? I might have. I don't remember. Were you invited to the private memorial? I don't believe so. Were you upset that you were not invited to the private memorial? Yeah, I was hurt. Why?
because at that point, you know, I still thought that uh, we were, that Michael and I were, you know, were close friends for a very long time, had a long relationship that, uh, you know, that I would have been included in something like that. Now that you wrote to <coughs> Jeff Thacker on June 26, 2009, correct? Yeah. Is the show that you're referring to in the last, second to last sentence or second to last line, you said, I wanted to write you now, so if you guys are thinking of doing any dance tribute to MJ on the show, I would like it to be me who does it. Do you mm -hmm. see that? Yeah. Is the show so you think you can dance? Yeah, I believe so. Okay. Is Jeff Thacker associated with so you think you can dance? Uh, yeah, he's a, he's a producer. Okay. It speaks to my compartmentalization at the time.